Hi, Wise Nubian. This is uh, Symbolic in San Francisco. Um, this is a video response to um, to your video response on the uh, the video uh, repartee that took place between uh, Donahue and uh, O'Reilly. Uh, in your video, you mentioned that certain groups um, tend to uh, tend to talk louder when they're making a point, and I wanted to enlighten you as to why that is. So I've put together these charts based on my extensive research. You see. The louder you are, the more right you are. Rightness goes up as loudness goes up. So you get this nice curve going up, see? So so just be loud. You'll be right. And this next chart also shows a related phenomenon, well, maybe related, that the more money you have, the more right you are. The rightness goes up too. So so the more money, the more right you are. Then I have, oh, here's another great one. Here's a, here's a good reason for it all. The louder you are, the, it's amazing. This is the downside. The number of women you get goes down. That's an unfortunate sacrifice you have to make if you want to be loud. You know, that you, you kind of, you know, the number of women you get will, will go down. You know, we often make sacrifices in life. Women... Apparently, they don't like that loud stuff, you know. Um, but here is here's the good part about this. See, here's the here's the compensation part. The more money you have, the number of women goes back up again. See, so 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 the more money you have, the louder they are, and you get money by being loud. So, so um, you know, so that's a good thing. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, the number of, now there are different type of woman, a different sort of woman that that you get um, you know when you have money but you know they're all women so it doesn't matter right um, if you have more women you'll have more sex right so the great thing here is the more sex you have the more head hair you get yeah you get more head hair now I've been I've been working on this myself for a while but uh, I'm, I'm, I'm still, I'm not loud enough yet, you know? And as you see here, if you put together loudness and you put together money and you put together, you know, related traits, what you end up with is something, some, something really valued in our, our, our in, the, in the predominant culture here, which is called ambition. Ambition is a great thing to strive for because you can be loud, you, you can make all the money you want, you gain success, and... And this shows you, this is up here is success, and this shows you that as ambition increases, your, your success increases. This is sort of a step graph or step curve, and as you can see, you, you, you achieve success by stepping over the backs of other people. See, you got to step over the backs of other people in order to achieve success. That's the great human staircase uh, of ambition. Um, and of course, you know, I, I, uh, what I did just to back this up, you know, um, to provide some, some mathematical proof is I put together all these very, these very cool statistics that prove that what I'm saying is right. See that? Yeah, that's good. Yeah. And, uh, just as the moral of the story, you know, the moral of the story that, um, be wrong. Be strong. If you're wrong, you got to be strong, man. you got to be loud, and you got to really press your point home and, uh, you know, step on the voices of others and silence them. Just silence those voices, you know, because that'll, that'll still stand in your way. Things, Small things like truth and honesty, that's not important. The important thing is to silence all the other voices and to be real loud. Well, you know, I hope you found this very enlightening, wise Nubian. Um... Um, I hope that it, 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 it'll guide you to a, a materially more successful life, um, win, you, win, you, win you more hair and more friends and, and all that. That's the story. Uh, any other advice, you know, feel free. I'm always glad to give advice and, uh, and more statistics. I'll, I'll pull those out of a hat, man. Take care.